Do I have a mentor? Yes, I do have a mentor. I have a teacher that I've been working with for 19 years. Do I have a mentor in the trading world? I do not. Um, it's hard to get at my level. It's hard to get mentors above me. It's not that they're not there, but they're usually very busy. And they, you know, unless I'm like a part of their team, like I'm on their hedge fund or something like that. Even when I was trading for the hedge fund, I often found out that I knew as much as my CEO or president, sometimes more. But I do have a mentor. I think everybody should have a mentor without a doubt. I don't care what field you're in, you should have a mentor. They don't necessarily have to be a mentor in your field, but everybody should have somebody that you work with that is your teacher. Because if you don't have somebody who you defer to, who you take instruction from on a consistent basis, and you understand their framework for mentorship, their approach, you have like a very established relationship with them, ground rules for relating to them. If you don't have that, then how do you ever go outside of your own mind? How do you ever go outside of your own thinking? Who challenges you to, forces you to think outside of your own thoughts, patterns, conditions, and habits? How do you ever grow unless you have somebody who is further along than you and that you have an established relationship with and ground rules for relating to them and you get constant feedback for them? How do, how do you grow? That's why I don't think anybody can really grow as a trader unless they have a mentor. There's a few people that can, but I don't know of a trader out there. Maybe Jesse Livermore, but he, yeah, Jesse Livermore might be an example. But if you look at all the great traders, especially market wizards, they all give credit to somebody that they trained with, every one of them. So the number of traders that are like exceptional traders that didn't have a mentor, very small, very small percentage, maybe 1%. The rest all had people they trained with and learned from. How is it possible to get very good at trading if you have no mentor? I don't think it is. Granted, I start off really well, but even then I struggled and got into my own personal resistance points in training where I needed somebody to give me feedback. You know, does Lionel Messi have a coach? Yes, he has several. Cristiano Ronaldo, does he have a coach? Yes, he has several. Tiger Woods, yes, he has several. Tom Brady, yes, he has several. Professional ballet dancers, Yes, they have coaches. Why would you think that trading is any different? Did Bruce Lee have a teacher? Yes. So look at all elite performers across a broad range of skills, performances, whatever. They all had coaches and mentors. Why would you think that's anything different? Why? Doesn't make any sense. I think you can get, you can build your skills without any mentor, but part of growth is having feedback. You need a feedback model. And that feedback model unless you're like 100% clear and relatively enlightened, your feedback model can't just be you and your interpretation of everything you experience in the markets. There has to be some perspective outside of you that gives you feedback. And it can't be software only because software is not going to give you feedback on your psychological performance, your biological performance, your mindset, your thoughts, your thinking patterns. It's only, software is only going to give you feedback on your actions but a lot of your actions, and it's gonna give you just based on end result, but it's not going to give you feedback on your internal process, and we're not robots as traders. We have internal processes that affect our output. So you need someone, something, and they have to have a framework, and a framework you understand, and an approach to give you feedback on. You always need feedback to grow, and that feedback has to be outside of your own mind, thoughts, conditioning, habits, whatever. It has to be. Otherwise, you're forever stuck in that. And so you need someone to give you structured feedback. The more continuous the feedback is, the more structured it is, the more personalized it is, the better. That's how you grow. How about using you and your channel as a mentor? There's no feedback though. It's passive. It's just whatever I put on the channel is passive feedback. There's no structure in that. Other than the frequency I give videos, there's no active feedback. You need an active feedback model. Think of it like, a professional athlete, do they look for a YouTube channel to get feedback or do they want active feedback, structured feedback within a framework of thinking, strategy, approach, skills, all that? Think about it like a professional athlete and then that will tell you how you want your feedback.